Hello, in this second tutorial on GTK I will show one of the simplest widgets, the label and we add something to the window, so to the container Ok, let's get started with the beginning So, first initialize uh, the GTK So, GTK init and you know, pass the address of RGC and the address of we Ok, so the command line argument um, address Ok, and then uh, we just de define a few variable this will be the window and oh, a pointer window and uh, we need a label as I said in the last tutorial almost anything is a, la uh, a v GTK widget in uh, GTK so a window is a GTK limit uh, GTK widget and a label is a GTK widget as well so create the uh, window so GTK window new GTK window top level simple enough you should know that already uh, we usually almost always pass GTK window top level to this uh, the others are called automatically uh, when you add something, uh, you know, create a so, we created a new window, as I said, you use the GTK and then uh, by the way, I think the generic form of the GTK functions are for first the GTK and then uh, the line, underscore, I think then what do you want? Uh, usually window and then what do we want to do with that we want to create a new one okay now uh, create the label so label equal gtk label new simple enough we just uh, use the gtk label new function the so the form is similar than the window okay and then you just press uh, the string literal what do you want to appear on the label so we just want to appear hello world text alright and uh, now just uh, make uh, the exit function you know just to you we can click the X button on the corner so it will exit the program so G signal connect as we have to terminate the program so window and de delete uh, event by the way uh, you may notice that it is uh, really not matter that you use underscore or dash so yeah really not matter so this is uh, the same as this it will be converted okay then w what function do we want to call we want to call the gtk main quit okay and what parameter do we want to pass nothing all right uh, now just add to the label to the window because you know we just created the window and separately we created the label but the label is not inside the window yet so it will not appear uh, anywhere actually to add something to the window actually to add something to the container it is a better word because not only window can be a container for example a button can be a container as well you use the GTK con container add function which requires two parameters a GTK container parameter and what do you want to add? So a GTK widget parameter. So, first of all, uh, we have to uh, convert it. As I said earlier, I should maybe said, so uh, you, r re you have to cast a lot in GTK because everything is gtk widget but the function not wait gtk widget everywhere so for example this wait a gtk container 
okay a gtk a window can be a container because it can contain something to cast a container we use a macro called gtk container okay and we pass the window okay and we pass the gtk widget what do we want to pass so what do you want to add to this uh, container to this window we press label by the way a button can be a container for example so we could uh, as you can see here it created an empty button and then add a, bo a box to it which has an image and a label so yeah we could do that in case of images all right the next thing you want to do is to make this entire thing visible so gtk show uh, gtk widget show all uh, we use the show all function i've already talked about show all function it will recursively go through all of the widget and make them visible start with uh, the window actually start with whatever we pass to this function we pass the, this function the window so it will start uh, with the window and uh, the l and uh, the only widget we have is the label so we could do that uh, to call the gtk widget show to the window and then a gtk widget show to the label uh, separately although it will make our program a little more longer with one line so i prefer this way and later when we have 100 widget we just call this one function not 100 function okay and then we just call the gtk main i think i uh, didn't forget anything but maybe uh, i am because i just uh, get up you know okay so go to my desktop and maybe we can use the program uh, maybe we can use the compile technique from the last program because you know uh, nobody want to type it in okay and uh, yeah all right now uh, let's uh, run the program i noticed that uh, not matter when i put the screen recorder uh, it will always appear outside of the screen so if i put this window the, in the center of the screen where the last window uh, appear so when the last test it will appear uh, on the current location where my screen recorder is right now so yeah uh, i always have to put uh, manually to the uh, window as you can uh, cannot see the result okay and here it is as you can see it is resized uh, to um, to the size of the widget so yeah you have to know always about gtk windows that they will uh, get the size automatically so they will get uh, uh, the widget and see how much is it and try to make the smallest size which can contain the widget uh, without any losses so as you can see we can resize it if we want to the GTK will automatically mm, uh, place the widget to the right place as you can see in this case it is the center of the window now uh, later we can change it if we want if not then okay all right uh, and I want to show you a function for oh a function for the GTK widget uh, GTK label is the GTK label set text okay uh, actually set the text here you will just see the set uh, you will just see the text wi which uh, is changed all the later we can use a button which if we click then change the text it is a more normal way i just want to show you now so gtk label set text okay uh, 
yes, yeah, this is the ordinary way of GTK function as you can see. GTK underscore all GTK functions start like that. A G signal connect is not a GTK function, it's from GLI, but don't worry about that. Then what do we want to change? Usually uh so yeah, it could be widget, button, label, notebook, anything you want. Then the next after underscore what do you we what do you want with that? For example we can put the new so we created a new. Now we put put the set text. Uh, there is a get text as well which will get the actual te uh, text. Okay. So okay now change the order of the word and uh, okay. Uh, oh, by the way, it will not know what uh, a label should we want to set. So first, we put the GTK label. As you can see, we cast uh, we casting again and label. Okay, uh, as you can see, we casting again. So usually, after you put some um, some function, first thing to do is to cast to the correct. Uh, 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 type of uh, whatever widget you want. So, in this case, GTK label set text will uh, require the first parameter a label. Usually, it's weight the first parameter, whatever we passed uh, here. So, yeah, this could be the uh, second uh, word. Okay, uh, the uh, exception is this because, uh, you know, we just created. Okay, and then change the word to uh, change the text to it to that. Okay, in theory it should run. And uh, as you can see, we already see the change the words, but uh, later, as I mentioned, we could add, uh, you know. Uh, a button which we click then the text will change okay that's for now because I am run out of time I'm afraid so thank you for watching and have a great day